and the very last day in March 2017 in front of us. Friday, March 31st, 2017. My dear friends, this beautiful Friday we will spend, well, here on my YouTube channel. So thank you very much for stopping by. And of course, with beautiful Jennifer Lopez. My dear friends, welcome once again. Thank you so very much for being here. Thank you for watching my channel. So, let us try to see together, you know, what type of energies we all can expect, what type of people, events, news or information for this beautiful, beautiful Friday, sunny, sunny day. Well, I hope it's going to be sunny day in your country as well. So, you already know, daily tarot reading are meant for all people, for uh, both genders, you know, for all 12 astrological signs, if you are by any case, you know, uh, new to my YouTube channel. So, you know, let's get started. Okay, first tarot card, four of pentacles, ace of cups, queen of swords, and knight of wands. Mm. Okay, so let us try to see what is here the message for all of us. First of all, four of pentacles, attachment, honey, are you attached to something or to someone which, uh, who basically does not work on your behalf? I don't know. Could be. Let me read. You are holding on to past. Attachment blocks you. Release your fear of losing so you can progress. Well, maybe this is the problem. Well, maybe not with all of you. But at least with some of you, I know that this reading will resonate. Okay, so ask yourself, are you attached too much to your parents? Are you attached too much to your business or to your job or to your colleagues or maybe to your friends? Maybe you are too attached uh, even to your uh, partner, could be your wife or could be your husband. Maybe you are afraid that you will lose something or someone. You can't live in a such a way, being, you know, full of fears and being too attached to some uh, cause or, or, or person or situation or aim or, you know, whatever. This is not good and this is not healthy. Okay, so what is basically that I want to say to you? What is the hidden message? Okay, stay with me. The very next set of cards is such a beautiful Ace of Cups emotional growth okay you are opening yourself up to emotional and spiritual growth love and romance will come your way first of all if you are too attached to the outcome honey this is not good at all if you are too attached meaning that you are afraid that you will lose someone most likely you will lose this person because we as human beings, we do not communicate with each other only with our um, uh, mouth and with our tongue. We basically communicate it every single second with our astral bodies as well. So, you know, uh, we all can read each other. Some people are so skilled in basically reading other people's astral body. So if you radiant um, fear from inside of you, people most likely ain't gonna like that at all. So uh, let it go, honey. Just let it go. If you're single, I can see fear inside of you. Not for all, not inside all of you, but you know, for Pentacles, at least in some of you, fear that basically you will stay alone until the rest of your life ain't gonna happen, honey. Don't worry about that because you have in your reading Ace of Cups. So you will, whether you like it or not, some kind of emo emotional growth is in front of you. Okay, now pay attention. The very next tarot card, Queen of Swords, uniqueness. Make unique decision for a better future. Your ideas are original and innovative. Act independently do you understand now someone 
will appreciate you just the way you are. Okay? So you don't have to hold to some eternal, you know, fear. You don't have to change that much basically yourself and, uh, you know, how you think and feel about yourself. Someone will like you anyway. Most likely this person is Libra, Gemini and Aquarius, but also I see someone else. Now, please look at the very last tarot card, Knight of Wands, break through. You advance with energy, optimism and creativity. You are courageous. Progress and success are on the way, but most likely not without this person. So this person will recognize you not as being, you know, funny or awkward or odd in some way. No, this person will say, oh, you are so interesting type of a person. Most likely this is a Leo, Sagittarius or an Aries. So uh, I feel that maybe uh, at least some of you, you want to hide some kind of um, uh, short comings inside of you. But this person, this person ain't going to see a short coming in you. No, this person basically will describe you as being unique. So this is exactly what you need to go through. And this is emotional, so-called, you know, emotional growth. When you will understand that basically you are perfect just the way you are. So hopefully you will understand basically uh, what is that I want to say. Don't be attached too long, too deeply, you know, too much for some, for some um, uh, imaginatory uh, picture, basically, you know, um, how you should look or how you should dress or how you should walk or talk, you know, just be who you are. So let go of this fear that basically no one like you. To tell you the truth, most likely this is friend that you already know. For some of you, this is completely someone new. But for some of you, I think that you will meet uh, in some, in some maybe even new circle of, uh, you know, of your friends. Especially somehow this person could be connected with your company. Uh, but especially I can feel, not that I can see, but I can feel this person basically could be a business client coming, uh, entering and exiting um, uh, from time to time in your shop where basically you are working maybe in your office when you are working or something, something like that. And then all of the sudden, out of the blue, this person, because this is not the end of the story just yet, now pay attention, this person also can offer you a job. How about that? Now, I can see so many modest Capricorns, Tauruses, and especially Virgos, you know, so very modest and, you know, you are kind of working in some corner of your company, corner of your office, thinking that basically no one can see you. But honey, wrong. Someone is, you know, someone already saw you and someone will, will kind of pull you on the surface in front of your colleagues. And then basically this is, you know, the biggest break through, not only for one day, not only for one week, not only for one month, maybe, you know, the biggest breakthrough basically of one year. So this is exactly what I can see. Okay. Okay. Now time for wisdom of the golden path guide book. So after shuffling, this is what I have for you, my dear friends. Now flame of inspiration. Okay, let me read what this tarot card is all about. First of all, pay attention. This is pure energy. This is pure passion. This is pure uh, sex. This is, this is so intense and such a beautiful, beautiful tarot card. First, affirmations. I hold infinitive creative power. I am inspired by life. I am in touch with my inner artist. Okay, what did say Albert Einstein? Logic 
will get you from A to B. Imagination will take you everywhere. So imagination is good, but you are too attached to basically to your reality. And maybe you stop um, your, uh, Im with your imagination for many, 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 you know, uh, years, uh, you know, already. But now you need to use your imagination because something is, you know, approaching to you. Uh, most likely something so wild, completely unexpected, unexpected. Okay, let me finish. Your imagination is fertile at present and you soon feel inspired to create. So honey, do create. As you tap into the infinite power of creativity, you hold within you new possibilities unfolds. See, an idea will come to you that will lead to an abundant and fulfilling future. Try to relax over the coming days. The more you are relaxed, the easier it will be. Now, this can be a time of ex exploration and romance, an enchanted and magical time. So, be it. My dear friends, there you go. This is all there is for one day. Once again, thank you so very much for such a nice comments and messages that I do receive from you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Please subscribe on my channel, like and share this video with your friends. Until tomorrow, I wish you all the best. God bless you all. Bye-bye.